Mexican guacamole. You will meet. Usually I do this with my husband, Diego Diaz, but, um, okay, cut, cut. This morning I woke up and Diego was absent and in his place was this note. It's very vague and I'm sure we can expect Diego back in time for tomorrow's show, so. <laughs> All right, first things first, let's cut up some avocado. You gotta make sure these babies are ripe. We're talking soft. We're talking ripe. I need a drink. I need a fucking drink. Dee Dee, are you okay? Fuck off! What we're gonna do is scoop its insides out and mash it up. Maybe you should lay off the gin. Maybe you should go kill yourself, Gloria. Now, longtime viewers of The Couple's Kitchen know that I have a bit of a phobia when it comes to citrus fruits. I'm afraid the pulp or acid or whatever the hell's in these little buggers will jump up into my eye and blind me. Usually Diego handles the lemons and limes, but <laughs> single woman! <laughs> Guaca guaca! <laughs> Guatemala! The last time I was in Mexico City, Diego and I actually took a hot air- I fucking, I fucking cut my finger. Why does this keep happening? Okay, so I'm gonna put this in the oven. Now what we need to do is season the damn thing, huh? So what we need is cilantro. So I just noticed that we are out of cilantro. <laughs> Diego was supposed to pick it up from the grocery store, but he's a son of a bitch, so what are you gonna do, right? So what the hell, let's just put some curry in it or whatever, right? <laughs> let's just put some goddamn curry in it. <laughs> so that's our guacamole. Bon appetit. It tastes like dog shit. So our little foray into guacamole didn't go so well. It's uh, essentially unedible. Inedible. Um, so luckily for us, avocado is a great face mask. So beauty time in the couple's kitchen. It's all for you, Diego. <laughs> My pretty Diego. Do you want me back?